to keep you updated, Listín Diario, the newspaper for the Dominicans, presents the most important news of the day. Monday, April 1st of 2024. There are a few places where a real improvise is not observed in Boca Chica, where the situation has reached the extreme that the Professor Rafael Delgadillo Primary School is surrounded by clusters of waste and the authorities of the Educational Center have made the decision to teach only three days a week. The Catholic Church made strong criticism of various social ills in the country, especially the injustice against migrants, the corrupt justice system, the exclusionary social security, the role of women in society, corrupt politicians, indifference to the deterioration of mental health, the cost of the family basket, the management of the crisis in Haiti, and deficiencies in education. During the Sermon of the Seven Words, delivered on Good Friday from the Prime and Cathedral of America. The legal consultant of the executive branch, Antoliano Peralta, considered that there will be no good government without good critics. When questioned about the criticism made by the Catholic Church during the reading of the Sermon of the Seven Words, where the religious highlighted some problems that affect the development of the country. During the Easter break, three femicides were recorded that bring to 13 the number of women killed by their partners or former partners in the first quarter of the year, a scourge that plagues dozens of Dominican families every day. The National Health System reported that the management of the Dr. Robert Reed Cabral Pediatric Hospital managed to transfer to the hospital of Boston, United States, of the 15-year-old teenager who was admitted affected by burns during a fire that occurred in the Salcedo Carnival. Relatives asked to investigate the death of a woman after undergoing several aesthetic procedures in a center for plastic surgery in Naples Culture located in the Arroyo Hondo sector of the capital. For this and more information, you can visit listingdiario.com for Listing Diario voiceover and translations by Indira Rodriguez. To keep you updated, Listing Diario, the newspaper for the Dominicans, presented the most important news of the day.